What's up, what's up everyone? I am the Insomniac Reviewer, number one hockey analyst on YouTube, and today the Chicago Blackhawks won 6-5 to take a 1-0 series lead. Awesome job, Hawks. It was definitely an exciting game. Not good defense or goaltending by any stretch of the imagination, but I'll get to that in a minute. Uh, the fly first goal was a bit lucky, but you know, to win you have to be lucky sometimes. Hawks got a lucky goal, so it, it did end up evening out. Hawks also had great bounce back. Bounce back is after every time the Flyers scored, bam, Hawks bounced back not too long after. Hawks have the ability to bounce back, back, <coughs> and that's what makes champions. It helps, well, it doesn't really make it, but it helps. It can be a make or break. Actually, it is a main thing. Every team has to bounce back if you want to be a real Stanley Cup champion. Uh, they also chased Michael Layton. Boucher went back in. This is exactly what I figured would happen. Hawks are faster, uh, more offense, more balanced lines, better defense. I figured in the Stanley Cup Finals, Leighton would come back down to earth. Because the Chicago Blackhawks have four great lines. Great lines. So the Flyers, two lines. And the Flyers are dangerous on any line. And they proved that by chasing Leighton. Now Leighton wasn't great, but either way, I'm, I knew Hawks would score. A good deal on any of them but Boucher went back in so it's nice to see Boucher again but you know uh, the Hawks didn't exactly have good defense or good goal time yeah we let in a few softies uh, the defense is poor the Hawks C game still won this game which would hopefully knock Flyers fans down because if it wasn't for the shitty defense by the, uh, the uh, Hawks this game would have been a blowout the Hawks would have won it pretty easily, but nope. So maybe people learned that the this is exactly what I thought would happen though, guys. That the Flyers really weren't even competitive for most of it. Hawks made they outchanced them, outshot them, they created chances by being faster. Ugh, the Flyers just have no chance. Unless the Flyers really collapse. I just see no chance for the Flyers in this series. And hopefully this will kinda knock some smart into you guys that the Flyers really have no chance in this series unless something major happens. The Hawks even have to bring their B game and still won. Um, they can play the run and gun 6-5 games. They can play smart defensively. I just can't. There's just no way the Flyers are going to outscore a much better Hawks team. Now another question I got to ask is should Boucher start game 2? Boucher only gave up one goal. I don't know how many shots it was exactly, but that's a tough question. That's a tough one after all. I would have to say, actually, it really don't matter. Probably either one of them is gonna lose. But considering Boucher played really good, they might give it to Layton because Layton's been good, you know, through the end of the second, third round. So they might give Layton another shot, and there's nothing wrong with that. Me, I would probably give Layton one more shot. But if he screws up again like that, then Boucher is in. But really, it ain't gonna matter. You can put any goalie in. Hawks are gonna win this. Hawks are just a much better team. So, exactly what I thought would happen. Peace out, everyone. Love you.